Hi, my name is Malik. My name is Awad. And today we're going to be showing you how to make a wind up toy. And your materials are paper cup, you go with the cardboard, cardboard, tape, pencil, stick, some rubber bands, a big paper clip, and a small paper clip, depending on how big your wind up toy is going to be. Your wind up toy is going to be scissors. Yep, and two, two um, paper plates, and a pushpin. The way that you make it when you start off is you start. So you get the paper cup and you put it down like that way. You put it down, and then you get the pencil, and no, this way. Right. Right. You gotta make a big circle. Oh yeah, with it. Yeah, and you make a big circle with a pencil and you trace it around. Yeah. Then, then you, you get cut it. You cut it with your scissors. You just gotta be careful. This and then so wonky. you make another one. But the thing is. You want to make sure that when you cut it out, you get a whole circle. Because even if it's a little bit square, it's going to affect the wind up tool and the way that it works. And then you put a hole in the middle of the circle. Yep. And you get, um, yeah. Like that. Okay, you have your hole, right? Yeah, so you get the hole, and then what you do is you get the two rubber bands and you tie them together. Into the other band. Then you put this side into this side and you pull it. <laughs> then you put a hole in the middle of the cup And then, with the paper clip, which we call the G hook, you bend it. You put what you it. do is you get the hook and you put it through there. And then you put it through this. You take the wheel, put it inside, and then it goes. And then what you do is you put it through once you got once you got this hook. You put what you it do inside. is you put it through the hole in the cup. And it had to meet inside exactly. And then you put it in. Then you pull it. Then you pull. Then you pull it. And once you're done pulling it, you get a Big paper clip. The small one, remember? No, a big one so you can stay. Then you put it inside. Come, come over here. Inside like this. Then you turn it. Then you put it in the middle. I don't know how much longer I can hold it. Then you let it go. And it should look pull. something like this. And then your uh, and then your wind up toy should look something like this. And turn it around to the other side. Like that. And then something like this. Yeah. Then with that, you get your paper, you get your cardboard, you put your it other cardboard side, and you put it through. And you also want to make sure you just put a square cardboard. Yeah. And then you roll it. Then you roll it. Then 
then you, you tape get, it. No. Then you cut off and tape. And then you and you put it. But inside. you gotta make sure that the rubber is thick. You put on the bead. Then you pull. And then with the stick. And what you do? The stick is you put it through and then you take off the Gary hook. Wait, you should take off the Gary hook before you, yeah. And then the you toy is done. Inside. The wind up toy is done. Except you have to make sure that it works. Only now you have to make sure that it works. So that's a simple process of just turning it around like that. Yeah. This is how it moves. Yeah. If you have a real bean beads, you can actually use it like this. And then you want to show it up so that they can see. Yes. And if you have to, you can from your older sister. And with this, this cup can see. Open. Even though it has a bead, don't worry about that. That's how I'm trying to show you. I'm trying to show you this. This is a plastic see-through cup. You can see what's going on with it. So you can see it going around. Like it. You can see how the insides of it work. You know. I need to do the pencil thing. If you don't have a bead, you can actually use a pencil Eraser. No, you mean not the pencil eraser. Take off the pencil eraser, remember? Take take the pencil eraser and take the eraser and you can actually use this. The metal part. Which the is, metal this part. is how it goes.